Keep your hands out! The Highly Rugby Club will be swapping the muddy pitches of Shropshire for Twickenham this Saturday. It was selected from 500 other clubs after entering a competition in a Rugby World magazine. The prize was the chance to field two teams in a match at the world famous stadium. But the club has humble beginnings. The club was formed uh, about 18 months ago when uh, two or three chaps who were rugby players in the village sat down in the pub one night and uh, thought we could organise a, a rugby club. And uh, from that uh, we organised an initial training session and uh, more and more people started to come to us and in 18 months we've uh, become a fully fledged rugby club. Everyone will be hoping to make a big impression, but who are the star players to look out for? There are a few boys out there who are going to want to be star players and they're all maybe going to have that white line fever at some stage, but really there are two or three fly machines in our side, I'd hate to say their names. <laughs> They'll all be quizzing me later on in the week who uh, I mentioned, but I think everyone out there is going to be a star to put on Saturday. This is the club's last training session before kicking off at Twickenham on Saturday, and naturally they'll be taking it easy, trying not to sustain any injuries. Well, if anyone did get injured, they didn't say. So what's it going to feel like treading on the same turf as England's World Cup winners? There's going to be a lot of nerves in front. Well, not just for me, for everyone in the change room. So. It's going to be unbelievable, especially where you've got like like the heroes like Lawrence Delalio, Martin Johnson, and people like that played there. Well, lined up in the tunnel is going to be just amazing. Just waiting to run out into the pitch where I used to go and watch as a young lad, watch England play. So it's just going to be out of this world. Um, it's uh, a dream come true for, for any rugby player to play at HQ, as it's known. Um, we, we can't really explain what it means to people. It, it, it's just, uh, as I say, a dream come true for these often inexperienced people, some more experienced players, to play there is, is, is just a wonderful experience for them. And enjoy it. If it's one score or it's no scores, we'll have played at Twickenham, OK? And we all enjoy Regardless it. of who wins, all the players will be telling the story of how they played at Twickenham for years to come. I'm Richard Tisdale, reporting for the Shropshire Star.